There are some Christians that are quick to preach, God always forgives sins. He always forgives the sinner. And possibly hell will not be eternal. Possibly hell is just the absence from God, not God's wrath. They preach that even if you take the mark of the beast, God can forgive you and he will forgive you. They teach that you can go on sinning and living for the devil, and at the end of your life, you can get into heaven. But I want to remind you today just how serious God is against sin and against sinners who take Satan's mark and refuse to repent. This is found in Revelation chapter 14. Then a third angel followed them, saying with a loud voice, If anyone worships the beast and his image and receives his mark on his forehead or on his hand, he himself shall also drink of the wine of the wrath of God, which is poured out full strength into the cup of his indignation. He shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels and in the presence of the Lamb. So if you think that hell is just the absence of God, you would be wrong. Hell, this place here, is the presence of God's wrath upon the sinner. And the smoke of their torment ascends forever and ever. So if you think hell is not eternal, remember what the scriptures say. And they have no rest day or night who worship the beast and his image, and whoever receives the mark of his name. Are we serious to really repent of our sins? Are we serious to stay away from the devil's mark? Or are you in the process of taking the devil's mark? Have you already taken it? May the grace of Jesus be with you.